I didn't do my usual walk-in because there are about 18 people behind me. Let me see what this is. Are you cracked? No, that's a hair. Oh. Let's see what this is. I can't read it right now. Oh, Williamsburg Pottery. Maybe we'll get this. Oh, it's got a broken animal on it or something. That was so cute. All right, I'll put it back. Um, just by looking on the shelves, there isn't really much new stuff out here. Uh, I'll go in more in depth with you guys. Uh, but right now is a run through really quick. And then um, I'll show you more stuff that's here. All right. All right, well, um, it is getting quite dry at this Goodwill, I must say. It is very wiped out. Uh, not much in the metal, not much in the wood. I will show you the metal in a little bit. And there's still poo on the shelf. And I'm looking here, we got some shelf units. Oh, those are very 90s right there, the teddy bear shelf. Um, here's some stampers couple individual stampers. I don't know if they were from a kid or not. And oh that's pretty cool. What are you? Are you for oh that doesn't open. Oops. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness it's falling apart. Alright so we don't even care what that is. Some little dishes I guess for candles. Uh very empty. Very empty. It's very strange. Um, well, that's cool. Somebody made that into a coat hanger for a Yamaha. Yamaha lover. Uh, not much here. Let's see. Yep, she's got a broken wing. Okay, so it might be a short trip today. It might be a short trip. What is this? Grinding something. Uh, no. Grinding wheel dresser. Ah, that's pretty cool. 309. All right, we'll see if we deck the halls with lots of shiplap. <laughs> That's cute. Uh, yeah, not seeing stuff here. Um, let me take you here very slowly over to the baskets. And um, unless it's a really, really cool basket, I won't get it. So uh, that's the baskets. Alright, I'm going to check out the toys and the mishmash, I think. Alright, toys are getting very empty as well. Don't, don't know what's going on here. As well as, let me move slowly. As well as these toys on this side, which are usually bursting with toys. So, uh, we're going to move back slowly on this side here and see if there's any toys, any plushies that spark my interest here. There's a peacock, but he's not very colorful for a peacock. Uh, I'm recycled. Um, there's a ninja. There's a porcelain doll, creepy doll for Chris. And, wow, I'm getting wiped down on stuff frame set, a couple games and puzzles and stuff like that, but not really seeing. Oh, poetry for Neanderthals. Okay, be back. We're in the mishmash aisle. This is getting empty as well. Uh, a lot of binders though, as usual. Whole shelf of face masks. Not much of wow. Holy moly, look at all this hair. Wow. We got hair, we got hair. And what's that? That's some kind of Western party. Oh, that's a cowboy for a party. Cowboy stuff. Tempera paint. Uh, hoping to find some craft stuff. I already picked up one of those, an older one. Oil filter, a phone handle, pencils, more hair, more hair, digital, little digital picture frame. And I'm noticing too that the prices are going up. There's less stuff here, but the prices are higher. So, 
I'm not really seeing much. I think uh, that's going to be it for the mishmash aisle. And I just want to show you here the records and uh, the DVDs. I think they're going to be starting to move all the media to online because it's never this empty. Never, never, never. That's it for their CDs right there. So this is all, this is all emptying out, unfortunately. It stinks. It really does. I don't see any video games here. So whatever's left here is um, some DVDs and that little bit of CDs. The books are thinning out as well sad it's sad okay even the dishes are getting sparse the dishes and bowls and everything uh, oh that's pretty why can't there be the other shaker to that that's really nice 209 a lot of crazing on it that's cool I wish it had those shakers uh, let's see no price on that nothing fantastic and sorry really not much to show everybody today oh those are neat but they're both broken they're both they both have chips on them i don't know if you can see the dragons those are cool those are cool uh, more emptiness maybe they're gonna stock less on senior day i don't know that's a cool box 509 for that and what are you? Mikasa cut and serve board. All right. All right. I uh, don't know what to show you guys. This is sad. This is very sad. <laughs> Look at that. What does that say? Saint something. It's a cat. It's a French cat. I don't know if they're all. Uh, it's Pimpernel. All right, I'll look them up since it's pimper now. I did grab a couple things here in the cart, uh, uh, a couple mugs, but that's really about it. Not much of anything else. Um, hopefully they'll start putting stuff out. I really don't want to be here all day waiting on stuff though. And the pots and pans, let's pan slowly to the pans. And nothing really grabbing me here either. Is that Mickey Mouse? It looks like a Mickey, yeah, it's a Mickey Mouse cake pan. And uh, just random thingies. Oh, that's a cute little cloche. That's adorable. But that's it over here on this side. Hope I can show you guys more. I'm getting low over here too, unfortunately. Oh, I don't know what we're going to do today. It's going to be a quick trip. I'm going to go through these in a little bit too. So you can see what's over here. First, here's the metal. We got a pogo stick. We got some baskets, some of the vases, cake cup holders. Uh, wow. <laughs> what can I show you guys? This is scary. This is scary. This is cute. There's a pair of those. Those are nice. Baby shoes. Brown shoes. I think an ashtray went in there. Yep. And silver plates. I, I don't know what to show you guys, honestly. Okay. So I'm here in the art, and she just filled. I got a couple grabbed a couple things really quick uh, oh that's pretty that's nice I don't see it signed or anything and that's cool too like the fall scenes botanical piece the peacock uh, it's not as nice as I thought it would be on the tail I'm very particular about peacocks um, that's one of those like metallic pictures that's old 209 be nice if there were two of them though uh, we have another botanical here and sandala stuff like that just peachy oh I think this is an Egyptian papyrus oh, 209 for that maybe I'll get that 
put it in the cart. I only see one, so I'm just gonna put that in the cart here. All right, I'll be back. These are interesting. They're uh, wine labels. They look like real wine labels. 409 each. There's a cute little mailbox painted scene. Uh, here's another one. But they're 409. We're not going to worry about that. And then we have other stuff here. We have a cow. Uh, another big picture. I don't know. Let's see? Wow. Not many lamps up there. Some down there. That cracked one's still here. I'll be back. This is very cute. It's a very tall bear. And that's good for an entrance way. He's cute. I'm not a crazy fan of the hearts. If it was not hearts, if it was like a slab of wood, that would be awesome. But that's a cool piece. It'd be 20% off 20 off of 1309. Cute. And adorable. So we have some old figurines here. Not not a great subject matter. Oh, he's cute. It's like a squashed gourd for a dollar nine. Uh, little boxer. Oh, his ear's broken. It looks like a hurricane went through this place, honestly. And I think the color of the week is blue. So maybe we'll find something that's been sitting here. I don't know. We'll see if the lemon's still here. I don't remember what color. Oh, there's a llama. There's a llama. That puppy dog is still here. Puppy dog. Uh, Pilgrim salt and pepper shaker. 309 now. Now I remember when I got all those, those other ones were $1.39 for the pair. So, yes, prices are going up. Cute salt and pepper shaker set. $1.09 for those. Um, I saw this cute... A glass bowl and that's neat but that's all plastic I wish it was wood and oh balls 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 we got a ball we got a ball here ball on the loose and love grows here um, little houses light up houses and move down here a little bit. Um, I'm not seeing anything worth showing you guys at all. That's sad. Just trying to look here. And this is neat. Which is this? 309. It's like recycled glass. It's pretty though. Purple. I was looking at this before. It's a very interesting piece, uh, the shape of it and everything, but look at the size of that chunk that got taken out of it. So we're not going to worry about that. Baseball coasters and snowman coasters. Uh, oh, a truck and a tree, salt and pepper, 309. Why? Why are you 309? Um, here's a little Asian inspired uh, doll. We have this, but um, something's broken off the top of it. And hand painted. I don't know what that says. Hand painted Betson? I don't know. Uh, $10 for that. So, yeah, uh, all of a sudden their prices are, are going up. So, and there's less stuff to choose from, too. Less good stuff. But I'll manage to find a few things today. And if I don't find a lot, that's that's okay too. This is a salt and pepper shaker. Province designed by, I can't read it. And this one's only 209. Now, why is this 209? And the pickup truck with the tree is 309. I don't know. I have no idea. But we'll look this one up. Put it in the cart. All right, let me switch us over to the other side. So there's some collector's plates on this side. This one is 309. And then we have these French whoops, collector plates by Pottery Barn. They're 309 each. And there are these women with these different different drinks. Well, I don't know. Yeah, I guess that's a woman too. 
Uh, here's a little snowman covered mug. Let me pick this up. Uh, then we have these uh, Arabian style collector plates. They're kind of pretty. Let's see how much you want for these. Ten bucks a piece. Oh yeah. Prices are definitely changing here. Times they are a change in. Uh, that looks like a little can. Here is a ladle. Looks like polychrome ladle. 309 for that. I'll probably break that. That's old. A lot of crazing. This is a pretty tin. 309 for the tin. They're usually like a dollar nine. It's pretty. But I can't really make much off of that. I really don't sell them for much. So um, we have a William Sonoma eggplant. All right. Well, I think we'll uh, hold on to that. Oh, more of the 80s geese. There's a little trinket box. Looks like the one from the other uh, from the other aisle. Praying angel. There's a little angel ornament. Really cute. She's holding a dove. Um, let's see over here. It's a little picture hand painted in Portugal. And um, I think we'll just take that for now and see what we have a little further up. Be back. This is cute. Little little piece. Dollar nine. I don't know what else would have gone with it, but that's a cute little piece. I love the color, the teal on it. We have a bear. We have a pretty vase, hand painted vase, but it has a chip in the bottom. So we're not going to get that. Oh, that's a little um, unicorn earring holder. There's an angel back there. There was a neat, um, there was a neat bell over here. This is pretty. Glass bell and it's frosted here. It's got butterflies on it. Then we have these that say God is light. That's kind of cute. There's three of those. And, uh, Oh, that's got a big old chip in it. That is a nice stone uh, candlestick holder. But it's right there on the top, the chip. There's only one. Uh, some vases. And... Oh, I don't know. Keep looking. Keep looking. See what else I can show everybody. Um, these are nice. This pair of candlestick holders here. Those are neat. 309 each. I don't see anything else down here. Here's another salt and pepper shaker. That spongeware look to it. Okay. Oh, these guys are still here. They're still oh wait, blue is half price, so these would be half price. Uh, one's missing a stopper, but you get them for half price not a problem and we have a chicken here oh there's the chicken that needed the egg salt and pepper shakers and i never got the eggs see that's what happens 89 cents for him now should i get him because maybe maybe we'll come across the eggs i never got the egg when they're here lesson learned okay i'll be back um what did I want to show you? I wanted to show you this piece, but it has a chip on it. 309, and it's something for a Mayan symbol. Now, I might have gotten that if it wasn't chipped, but I don't know. It's a cute little vase. Uh, 309, looks like Portugal or Italy. They're not really selling that good for me. A lot of broken stuff, a lot of broken stuff on the shelf here. A lot of broken stuff. Um, here's a cute little purple bottle, but no stopper, but let's not talk about that, shall we? After what happened at my booth. Um, there's a little Santa sled that looks like an older planter by gauging by the bottom of it. And that's all I can show you over here for now. What is this? This is a cute little truck for 89 cents. Mm, that's very light. Okay, be back.
I'm gonna look for my half of my lemon. So the electronics are wiped out too. Crazy, crazy. This is cool, it's a cast iron double spoon rest. Uh, made in China, 509 for that. They just put this out, it's really cute for 309. I think you put a candle in it, but there's a piece of wood broken off of it. Oh, I was interested in this for jewelry supplies. It has some little containers in it. Um, little box, right? 609 for that. So we're just going to leave that behind. I, they might be worth money. I'm not sure. So we're going to leave that. These are nice too. These glasses. They're $1.09 a piece. Very cute. And what is this? A sign of peace. It says peace. Peace, peace, peace. All right, we're going to keep looking. So here's miscellaneous aisle number one. Here's a big bag of fruit. All sorts of fruit in there. That one's 709. And then we had another one here. This one is 709. It's got apples, oranges, and lemons. Uh, let's see what else is here. Um, these here, they're not 69 anymore. Like uh, last time, they marked them up to 209. And I did grab a couple things off of here. I'll show you guys later. Nothing, you know, super fantastic or anything, but uh, these guys here, poinsettias, we have an acrylic mer mermaid, 209, if she was a dollar nine, I would have got her to sell on my channel. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe to my channel, hit that like, comment after you watch it, comment below. I also sell this stuff on my channel from time to time. And if you're interested in anything and I haven't had a sale yet, please feel free to email me. It's in my description area. That's a pretty, uh, a pretty picture frame. Okay, what's in here? This is 309 and you have cat note cards and other note cards and other greeting cards in there. I would just want the cat note cards, so that's not really worth it for 309 for me. I mean, it is worth it for the having cards in there. We'll look in here. Can you see them? Cards. Cards are expensive. Oh, this is a lap thing for your um, when you have your laptop on. You put this and put it on top of it. That's what that's for. We have some gift wrap over there, and I don't think these are vintage cards. Happy birthday. And we have, oh, puppy and kitty. Yeah, I don't need it. People really don't do cards that much anymore. That's pretty for the candles. That's kind of nice. Not in the Christmas mood yet, though. This is a eye mask, slippers, and neck wrap aromatherapy relaxation set. I don't know if they've been used because they taped the box and that's usually when there's something wrong. 309 for that. Feel how soft. Yes, very soft. So, pretty cool, but not going to get it. Uh, we have a snowman cookie jar. We have three ghosts. <laughs> they say boo. 309 each. Wow. They're usually 89 or $1.09. They're 309 each. We have some Avon. Uh, things too. I don't know what this guy is. Hallmark. He's Hallmark and he's 509 for him. And we have another canister here. And this cute little basket for your wall. Basket of eggs. That's adorable too. All right. Just want to show you guys. This is a cute, I guess it's a warmer. Um, it, they made it look like a little stove. It's really cute. It's not marked, but it's uh, it'll be 20% off of 209. Isn't that cute? This comes off here. So maybe you could do wax melts, or if you just want to burn a candle, you can leave that part off. That's cute. That's a cute little design. I like that. But it's not marked at all. Oh wait a minute, is it? No, that's just the design. All right. 
uh, cigar box here. You got some tea. You got some witches. And more tea. I wonder if the tea is expired. Let's see if we can get down there. This is uh, 69 cents. Made in Poland. Oh, they're from Ollie's. I'm trying to see here. Uh, oh, they're still good. They're still good. I think it's all that. Yeah, it's the same flavor. Yeah, it's the same flavor. So we're not worried about that. Okay. Oh, look. Here's a little Mike. Little Mike. Dollar nine. I would have gotten for 69 cents. Okay, gonna move on. See what else they bring out for the next little while. Might not be staying long. Might not be a long video. So here in the wood aisle, it's a whole package full of key bottle openers. So the, I uh, don't know how you would open a bottle with them. Because they don't look like bottle openers. Oh, somebody broke something, wasn't me. There's no way those are gonna open bottles. There's no way. I don't know why these are called key bottle openers. And they have tags to them too key part of our life. Thank you for being a key part of our lives. All right, so that's probably for a wedding and 709 for those and then I saw a box of nails for 509. Uh Not looking good people's. I got a little bit. I'm happy I got a little bit. Ooh, that's a nice big basket there. Cats would love that. Okie dokies. All right, they must have just put that out. It's a magazine stand, uh, 609, but it does it is chewed up there on the top. So we're not going to grab that. Somebody might get it. Somebody ought to grab the birdcage looking thing right, right after I looked at it. So that's interesting. Maybe it's a bookend, 309. I've had these before. I think I still have an original set. These are just wood blocks. These are signs. They're $1.09 each. And... Oh, that's cool. It's a bookshelf. And they made it look like a plane. Oh, that's cute. It's upside down. Looks like an airplane. That's really cute. I don't have room for that in my booth, though. Unfortunately. So, we're going to skip that. We're not going to give up, though. We're going to keep looking for a little bit. There's a little pirate ship kit. Cute, cute. Um, this basket is quite large 409 oh i like that it looks like it's got some age to it it looks like an animal was gnawing on it uh nice big basket i don't have anything in my booth that i need to put in the baskets that's that would be good for uh putting artwork in though as a matter of fact that would be great for putting artwork in so i could stand it up because i don't have wall space you know what i'm gonna think about that i'm gonna think about that basket it's a possibility okay i'm gonna keep going Here's the uh, totes, you know, backpack kind of area here. Not much to look at, so I just want to show you. This is cute. It's a, a flag, and it's all Lego, Lego characters on it. Really cute, but I don't see a price on it. Oh, wait, what does this say? Oh, happy birthday. It's a happy birthday banner. Okay. Ooh, a high eight tape. 109. Hmm. I'm slowing down on getting stuff like that. Electronics. Oh, this is cool. This is for your tissues. Looks like it's from a hospital. And we have, you know, adult diapers. And then we have these chin straps here for $1.29. Lock sliders. Hmm. Interesting. We have more hair. We have more hair. We have hippie buttons for $209. Uh, nothing else in the box. We have doll kits for $309. There's that one. And there's that one. And they're porcelain. There's a cigar. Oh, it's heavy. Oh, because somebody put a candle in it. Cigar box. What are these? Moonlight story reels. Oh, that's cool. You attach it to your phone? That's weird. That's interesting. Another case. There's another one. They're different. 
I don't know anything about them, so no clue. This is an Air Force magnet. That's neat. Okay, what is this? Paw print kit? Paw print ornament kit. How much are you? 209 I might get that. I might be using that. Okay, the bamboo bees are still here, guys. Somebody had to open it up to see what they were. The bamboo bees. And we have... What is this? 3D cookie cutter. Make a giant kitty cat cookie. Oh, that's so cute. That's adorable. 224. That's weird. That must have come from another place. Uh, it's getting a little busy in here, guys. So I'm going to have to move away from here. I uh, can't hear myself think all of a sudden. All right. Whoops. Running over something here. Okay. Let's get out of this aisle. I'm going to check out some salt and pepper shakers in a basket, 309. Too bad they weren't plain eggs for my chicken. Okay, I'll keep going. Okay, I saw this. This is a neat crock. It's got a lid on it. Um, it's blue, 309. It looks like it's got some age on it, but it's not. Well, maybe that is a marking right there. I'm not sure. We're going to grab it. It's got a lid, so that's cool. I just wanted to show you guys. This looks like a little kitty cat. Well, a big kitty cat mug for 109 And a beautiful Hawaii sea turtle mug. It's Hawaii for 89 I don't know if anybody's interested in that. Um, but you know what? I'm going to get it anyway for the heck of it. Oh, that's adorable. I bet that had a lid to it hand-painted Nasco. That looks like it matches those mugs. I, I guarantee you this probably had a lid to it. Shine. Uh, let's see. This is pretty. It's got like a mandala on it. What is the brand? Ozark Trail. That's cool. Unless somebody brought it in here and they were drinking. But they just moved this stuff back so I think they're going to be bringing some stuff out shortly special agent fbi federal bureau of intoxication oh my goodness it's a coffee mug what is this this looks oh it's got schmutz on it 69 cents that is like for soup or something it's only one it's only one so we're just gonna leave it i mean single people like me appreciate the single mugs for sure. Protonics with Cheshire Cat, I think. Or no, I don't know. Maybe it's an, a bug or something. That's weird. Okay. And there's a glass stein. All right. I'm not seeing. That's cute. That's a cute little set. Sugar creamer. Uh, let's look here. These are pretty. I took a picture of them earlier, and then that duck, duck one. Hopefully, they'll bring some stuff out. This is uh, IBM, the technical advisor. It is plastic, and it has a lot of crazing in the plastic. I don't know if you can see it there. See that in the reflection? So I'm not getting that. Okay, keep walking around. Just want to show you how cute those flowers are. This is Mark Cataran Belvedere gravy boat, but aren't they cute? Just wanted to share that. So I just wanted to show you guys. This is the creamer and sugar that match that coffee urn uh, when I was here last time. 309 each but there's no lid to this and uh, the urn's gone so but they're really cute they have really nice lines hi I see you in there hi I'm shocked the Wii tower is still here this is where you put your Wii all your Wii stuff oh this one's different the other one was white and really tall okay so this isn't the same one this is a different Wii tower alrighty Traffic jam, traffic jam, tons of people here, guys. 
really hard to get through here. There is just people everywhere, everywhere. Old people everywhere. <laughs> so under here is a spoiler for a car. I don't know what kind of spoiler, but I mean, I don't know what kind of car the spoiler's for. Maybe for a Miata, it's very curved. 20 bucks, it's got all its hardware and everything. That's pretty cool. Just wanted to share that with you guys. I gotta turn around. So this is cute. It's three-piece hanging mason jar and tea light set. It'll be 20% off of 509. One of the hangers is missing, but it comes with tea lights in it and like acorns and pine cones and stuff. It's really cute. It's really cute. So this is a beautiful um, pottery tray. Really pretty. I love the colors in it. Love the colors. I don't know if you can see the detail in this. Uh, 209 but not for food use so I still like it as like a display I'm gonna put it under my cart for now or somewhere in my cart and <laughs> my cart's a little full right now I'm gonna put it over here on the side and see if I'm actually gonna get that or not the uh, could you not though dish is still here as well um, my card is full. It's with a couple big things that are filling it up. So uh, I'll be back. So this is a good price, $409. Uh, that's for when your pets travel with you. You strap them in. Pet Bobby. Uh, I think that's what it is for when they're in the when you're in your car and they strap them in. I think that's what that is. And then here, this is adorable. It's a little luggage. It's R two D two. How cute is that? They've traveled a lot. There's a lot of scuffs on that, but that's really cute. What is this per Innocent? Innocent brand purse. No idea. No idea. A little tapestry bag, travel bag. Missing the strap to it. I just wanted to show you that. That's a great deal. But uh, my cats are not to that point where I can strap them in and... These go for a lot of money, though. Somebody's going to pick that up. That's a great price. And I don't know what this thing is here. Let's see. This is weird. I don't know if it's for an animal or not. It doesn't have much breathing room in it. Really weird looking. It's got a domed lid on it. 609. Here's a big basket. What is that? Hima Kuraken. K U R U A K Y N. Oh, look, it's a whole picnic set in there. How cool is that? I have one of those I have to actually bring into my booth. Um, let's see what this thing is up here. Media thing. User-friendly media component. I don't know what that is. It's an enclosure. HDD. No idea what that is. It was $39.99, and they have it for $10.99. I don't understand what it is, though. Quiet hard drive enclosure. Okay, that's what it is. That's what it is. Here's an IBM ThinkPad bag. I just wanted to show you over here by the luggage. That's pretty cool. There's an Air Jordan backpack, so that's worth mentioning. So this is a good deal, too. These are um, spice jars. They're shaped like diamonds, so I guess you put five and five. Brian, it would have probably been like Brian, two rows of five on a spinning rack. So uh, 209 each pack of four. So that's not a bad deal. That's, that's actually pretty good. I don't need them. So not for me. I'm just seeing if they put anything else cool out here with the cookware. And I'm not seeing anything. It is just loaded with people here. This is driving me nuts. I can't. Let me show you over here real quick. Taking another pass here. I think I'm gonna wait a couple more minutes and then I'm gonna go. I hope I got enough footage of cool stuff to show you guys today. Still have to do the recap. So I saw this piece here, and uh, it's thirteen oh nine, and it is a jewelry armoire, complete with a band aid. Mm, yummy. And these are like angled. They come out like that. It's kind of neat, huh? I don't know. They sit in this lip or something like that, I think. There you go. These are all stretched out, unfortunately. But I wonder what they did with the jewelry. Okay.
So just wanted to show you guys that. So I don't know if I showed this before. It's the cat's meow. Uh, dollar nine. I don't know. That I put cat food in there. It's just gonna scratch. So, and these are pretty too. There's two of these for 89 cents. They're kind of neat. Um, it's slowing down in here finally. So what I'm gonna do is oh, we got some geese salt and pepper shakers. What I'm gonna do very shortly is do my recap and get out of here, guys. I'm gonna get out of here. I don't see anything else new coming out, so I think it's my cue to leave and leave the rest to everybody else. What is that? It is chip, that's what that is. All right, we'll do a recap shortly. All right, everybody, time for the recap. I'm gonna get this shelf unit for my booth to add a little bit more uh, shelf space in there. So it's gonna be 20% off of 609. Uh, this big basket is 409. I'm gonna put standing um, paintings and artwork in it. So I don't have I don't have a lot of wall space for it, so I'm gonna use that. Here's an interactive poo from the 90s. Who doesn't need some interactive poo in their life? Uh, I like this vase. It's pretty cool looking, nice lines to it. This black display thing um, for little pieces of jewelry or whatnot in the in the booth. Uh, the Beatrix Potter pieces. I have that one and this one. And then we have the papyrus here, Egyptian papyrus. Uh, this I'm going to use. This is an IKEA plate stand, so I'm going to use it for oddball plates in my booth. So I got some stuff for the booth. I got. Um, I'm getting the spongeware shakers. I found one of the eggs for the chicken, but we don't have two eggs, so I'm gonna get him anyway, and hopefully, he's only 89 cents. Hopefully I'll find the other uh, egg for it. Uh, this is cool piece. Bourbon and rye um, shaker, barware. This crock, a blue crock. Uh, some little houses, salt and pepper shakers. Yeah, so these are like for tags for hanging jewelry or whatnot on them. So it's a dollar nine a package. There's three packages of it. Let me move this over here. I'll show you what's under that. And we have a paw print ornament kit. We have a Hawaii sea turtle mug. We have an art pottery mug. It's uh, got pretty flowers around it. We have this art pottery mug with the little thumb thing there for your for your finger at the top of the handle. Um, this is a perfume decimator from the early 1900s, uh, which is pretty cool. So that's neat. So I'm getting that. Uh, I'm going to take a chance and get the tree in the pickup. No, maybe I won't. Maybe I won't. Let leave that one out. I'm still on the fence. Uh, 209 for this. Is he chipped? No, he's not. For this glass dolphin with the frosted waves. Put that in there for now. Uh, these are really cool. They might be pillowcase covers. Ethnic Crafts uh, Cashmere Chain Stitch Collection. There's, I think there's two in each one, so they'd be, it'd be off of $2.99. So I got that one and this one. I'm really interested to see what the, what they're gonna look like when they're open. Um, little owl shelf sitter. Then we have um, Pimpernel coasters and their French cats. I don't know, Black Dahlia might like something like that. French cat. Um, we have the Williamsburg Pottery, we have a Superman mug, uh, the bottom's got wear, but I think the emblem is okay, double check that. I'm going to put back the Williams Sonoma eggplant, I really, I don't know what I was thinking with that, I think I'm going to put that back. Um, just make sure oh does that have wear on it it might do something when it's trademark let me see this other side here it's got somewhere to it i might put that one back 
uh, Triple Dog Dare You Christmas Story mug. I uh, was thinking of this kitty cat one, but it's not uh, it's not very good quality for two oh nine. I don't think I'm gonna get that either. Uh, this piece is cool. I think I'm gonna put it back. It does have a crack there. You see the crack in it. Uh, made in England. And then we have the Slytherin. I have the snake, the plush snake, and I have the scarf. So it'd be nice. Maybe I could do a whole set around Christmas time. Harry Potter. But um, that is it. That's what I got. And I'm happy and I'm going to go. If you haven't already subscribed, please do so. Uh, hit that like. Leave me a comment underneath. Oh, that pottery tray I might be getting too. Um, and I do sell this stuff on my channel. So if you're interested in something, uh, contact me via email in the description area. And I will put it pinned in my pinned comments. The very first comment after this process is will be the link to my entire Thrift With Me Goodwill playlist. So you can uh, do a little binge watching if you like. So again, thank you for watching. Talk to you guys soon. See you on the flip side. Bye everybody. Thank you.